it's not you it it's me well it could be you who knows whether you cover your nose or not my hands are tied bound by these boundaries and i tried to leave but you wouldn't believe they told me to stay inside that's insane they told me don't follow my heart and stay six feet apart else i'll end up six feet under and i wonder what happened when you fell for me did i catch you or did i catch corona I don't know now. I thought I was safe with Lysol and toilet paper, but that was just lies all over the newspaper. This thing lies all over the newspaper I was handed, and now I'm stranded, constantly in sanitization, feeling the insanity caused by this threat to humanity. <laughs> this virus pull a Miley Cyrus and come in like a wrecking ball. Get this flecking ball of germs away from me. I didn't ask for this case of corona. And I can't even return it because this thing shut down all the bars with its rifle, trying to stifle me with shortness of breath. <sighs> I thought it was just asthma. But now my plasma is infected. Now I'm afflicted and conflicted. I thought it was just a sinus. I didn't sign us up for this long distance relationship. Now all I'm hearing is resistance and social distance. And I'm sick and tired of being sick in this toxic relationship. Who knew that our last date would be before the date Corona took me on a date with Destiny. <laughs> and they're not even nice. I should have think twice before I decided to act on fiction instead of fact. Imagine the one you love touching your face with a glove. And I can't. Ask why are you kissing me with a mask? I'm trying to mask my emotions, but I just wish I could turn back time. I would have never go out and lime. I should have listened to Miss Eugene when she talk about good hygiene. Now I stuck in quarantine with COVID-19 because of my irresponsibility. And now my only responsibility is to send you this message from six feet apart.